Okay, let's determine whether or not the relation can represent a function. We're also asked to identify the domain and the range. Okay, so let's do that as well. Okay, so um, to determine whether or not it's a function, remember that every element in the domain can only pair with one element in the range. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is list out all my x values as my domain. So that's negative two, three, seven, six, and negative six. That's all the x values, oops. Okay, and then all the y values, all the y values are one. So range is equal to one. Okay, so let's see how this matches up. Negative two is one, three is one, seven is one, six is one, negative six is one. Okay, every element in the domain matches up with only one element in the range, only one y value. So this one is a function.